Okay, here we are, another, what was this, uh, episode 7 of uh, Anarchist Channel, Child Custody. And, you know, I'm still stuck here in uh, Quartzsite, Arizona. I'd like to be at home working on other things, but, uh, you know, I'm stuck here because my car's broke down. And I did start a new project, you know, I am selling, uh, sage, uh, uh, really good, sage, uh, smudges that collected out here in the desert. Um, they're ready to go, but the car isn't. So, you know, I was talking to my aunt just the other day, actually it was last week, and she was sharing with me, uh, some things, and I would just like, you know, why the reason I'm doing this is to raise awareness. One, for my personal cause, me trying to get, you know, custody of my daughter, but it's also the, the cause of all fathers out there that, that think that in order to get you know, visitation, custody, shared custody of their child, they're going to have to pay a lot of money for it. And, you know, my car's broke down. My car needs the money. I, I don't even have the money to be sending to my daughter, you know, which in a couple of days is her birthday. And I'm very distraught that I'm not going to be there for her again this year. And, you know, I've sent her a card and you know, that's about all I can afford right now, and I don't even think I'll get the phone call I requested in it, you know, because her mother is just being so um, irrational, and, you know, it's really funny because this thing has been positive. This series of videos I have been doing has been positive in that People are talking about it. People within my family, um, my friends on Facebook. Um, I'm starting my website now. is starting to get some traffic. Um, so I, I'm raising awareness, and and that's a good thing. I'm not sure if I'm gonna uh, get my goal of shared custody um, without going to court, but at least. I'm able to, I, at least I'm getting some people to talk to me more about it. And that's, that's, I think, where the solution lies, is talking. But it, it's really disturbing because a member of my family um, had, you know, intervened, or I would like them to intervene on my behalf, but they just refused to. And, you know, I can't compel anybody to do anything. Uh, but I just hope that the, uh, the, that these videos continue to um, give hope to myself because uh, you know it's really difficult, especially like right now when I want to be with my daughter on her birthday, um, to be doing something constructive to solve that problem, and I don't want to go running to the government or a lawyer, or a family law court, or anything to get relief, because I don't have the money, my daughter is a sovereign person, she's not, um, you know, state property, so why is it that we have to go to the state, why do I have to go to the state for redress? It just, it makes no sense to me, um, and it's totally abhorrent. But anyway, that's what's going on with me uh, right now. Um, thank you very much for your support, and you have an awesome day.